Are we alone in the universe? This question has been in the minds of scientists for centuries, capturing the imagination of people everywhere and driving countless other questions of the unknown. Many scientists believe that Earth isn't the only place in the universe to host life. But considering just how big the universe is, with an estimated two trillion galaxies, perhaps then a better question is, are we alone in the Milky Way? Join us on this cosmic journey, are we alone in the galaxy? According to a new study published in the Astrophysical Journal, researchers from the University of Nottingham suggest that the Milky Way galaxy is home to 36 communicating intelligent alien civilizations. But how did they arrive at this very specific number? They say the estimate is actually conservative, and it's based on the assumption that intelligent alien life forms on other planets in a similar way to how it does on Earth. The scientists assume that Earth is not special. If we imagine a planet much like ours orbiting a star like our sun, hosting a civilization that develops technologically in a similar way to humans, and under the assumption that it takes 5 billion years for intelligent life to form, then there would be at least 36 Earth-like civilizations in our galaxy. Previous calculations of alien life have been based on the Drake equation, which includes seven factors needed to find the number of intelligent civilizations. But the estimates have been extremely broad, ranging from zero to a few billion civilizations. With this new method, the researchers refined the equation using new data and assumptions. They found that there are likely between 4 and 21 civilizations, with 36 being the most likely number. However, finding these civilizations is another issue entirely. Scientists said they would be thousands of light years away. But let's begin by exploring Proxima Centauri b, the nearest exoplanet that may potentially harbor alien life. This intriguing world orbits within the habitable zone of Proxima Centauri. The habitable zone, or the Goldilocks zone, is the region around a star where the conditions are just right for liquid water to exist on a planet's surface. In this zone, the temperature is ideal, neither too hot nor too cold. Proxima Centauri b is very similar in size to Earth, with a mass of approximately 1.17 Earth masses. This suggests it's only about 10% larger in diameter than our world. The planet is likely tidally locked, meaning one side of the planet always faces the star, receiving constant daylight, while the other side is in perpetual darkness. There could be three distinct climate zones due to tidal locking, a hot sun-facing side, a cold dark side, and a potentially habitable twilight zone in between. If alien life exists on Proxima Centauri b, the unique conditions of being tidally locked could lead to extraordinary adaptations. On the perpetually lit side, life forms might have evolved to withstand continuous exposure to the star's radiation, possibly developing protective mechanisms or using the constant light to their advantage, perhaps through photosynthesis-like processes. On the dark side, organisms could have adapted to the extreme cold and constant darkness, possibly relying on geothermal energy or other forms of heat different from starlight to survive. Now, if intelligent alien life exists on Proxima Centauri b, the implications would be astonishing. First, it would suggest that intelligent life is likely common throughout the galaxy. Considering the Milky Way hosts an estimated 400 billion stars, the odds that the only two planets with intelligent life happen to be neighbors would be astronomically low. Second, the discovery could provide clues into the nature of space travel among extraterrestrial civilizations. If these neighboring beings have not yet made contact, it could indicate that even for a more advanced alien society, interstellar travel is an even bigger challenge than we thought. Or it might also suggest that they are technologically less advanced than we are, positioning humanity as the potential first interstellar visitors. In this scenario, we would be the aliens arriving on their planet. However, before we get ahead of ourselves, it's crucial to remember that these ideas remain purely speculative. The existence of extraterrestrial life, let alone intelligent life beyond Earth, has yet to be confirmed. Another intriguing candidate for hosting alien life is Kepler-62e, a super-Earth located about 1,200 light-years away. And here's why this exoplanet stands out. Thanks for joining us on this cosmic journey. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the video on your screen for more mind-bending content. Until next time, Keep gazing at the stars. This is Cosmic Inquiries, signing off.